Welcome to this episode of Tech Talk with Tom Griffin. I am Tom Griffin. At Tech Talk, we introduce engineers to technology trends, news, and product reviews. Today's technology trend addresses designs using RF ceramic filters for next generation communications with CTS's Clearplex Waveguide ceramic filters. Demand for information through wireless devices is projected to grow 10 times by 2017. As demand for information increases, bandwidth and capacity are becoming more limited in an already congested spectrum. The wireless industry is responding to this challenge by migrating from macro cell architecture, where a high power base station serves a large geographical area, to a new model that uses many small cells. While small cells only cover a small area, when grouped together, they provide the necessary coverage and increased capacity at the same time. Air cavity filters have been the prime choice for macro cell topology for their superior overall performance and power handling. However, air cavity filters are large, heavy, and expensive, therefore not ideally suited for small cell applications. Design engineers must find a solution that can maintain a high level of performance while offering other critical benefits such as space and cost savings. CTS's Clearplex Waveguide Ceramic Filters offer that solution. CTS, a world leader in frequency products, ceramic and EMI filters, dip switches, potentiometers and sensors, has introduced this revolutionary new product. The Clearplex Waveguide technology takes advantage of CTS's patented mechanical structures and proprietary high quality ceramic formulations. It offers a filtering solution that satisfies the market's need for low cost, small size, and superior electrical performance. Key attributes include low insertion loss of less than 2.5 dB, sharp rejection points reaching up to minus 80 dB, passive intermodulation levels average minus 110 dBm, and in applications where power is critical, Clearplex can withstand peak power exceeding 500 watts. With us today is Ronan Cohen, RF Ceramic Filter Product Manager at CTS. Welcome, Ronan. Thank you, Tom. Today, I'm going to show how Clearplex performance compares with the traditional RF ceramic filters in this space. In this live demonstration, we will show the three levels of filter gradings. The first grade is the monoblock, which is considered to be the lowest performance grade ceramic filter. Here, we have a Band 2 TX RF ceramic filter. On the other hand, of the scale is the air cavity filter. This is a band two duplexer. In between the ceramic monoblock and the air cavity filter, we have CTS patented Clearplex ceramic waveguide filter. We will now show you the performance comparison between these filters on the network analyzer. Prior to this demonstration, we took a snapshot plot for comparison of the monoblock filter and the air cavity filter. I will now connect the waveguide filter for comparison with the monoblock. As you can see, the higher Q of Clearplex waveguide filter gives us a tighter rejection performance. Therefore, the attenuation levels are sharper, the insertion loss is superior to standard monoblock filter. Now moving to the air cavity comparison, I will recall the pre-saved setup of an air cavity filter. As you can see, the air cavity has higher Q than the monoblock, but the Clearplex waveguide filter achieves a higher Q with much sharper rejection line than the air cavity filter. In conclusion to this demonstration, we can observe the enhanced performance of Clearplex waveguide filter compared to the RF ceramic monoblocks on one end and the air cavity on the other end. Thank you, Ronan, for that great demonstration. CTS has patented Clearplex Waveguide Ceramic Filters, the ideal solution for your applications where size, weight, and cost are critical. Thank you for watching this episode of Tech Talk with Tom Griffin. See you next time.